Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. It's Kente Johannes with It's Necessary. I pray that everyone is having an amazing day or has had an amazing day on purpose. And remember, it should always be on purpose because it's your choice. But um, I just decided to take myself on a little drive out here and y'all, these winds are bananas. But to God be the glory anyhow, he's blowing some things away. And um, just like he did in this whole pandemic, you know, some things that were in our lives that shouldn't have been, he blew them away. But um, yeah, so I, like I said, I took myself on this little drive and I decided to pull over and share my thoughts. You guys, this whole quarantine has been a blessing in my life. It's been a blessing in disguise. I tell you, literally my life, I was, you know, I'm a hairdresser, so I'm constantly in the salon, um, trying, you know, I was trying to write my book and different things like that. But because he should, the Lord allow us to get shut down. He allowed us to get shut down. Remember, he's in control of everything. During the whole shutdown time, we were able to refocus and reset our lives. So that means when we come out of this completely, we're going to be better if we choose to be better. I This has just been opportunity. The Lord has blessed us with this opportunity to reset, to refocus, to stay focused. And just to be just this resilient people that he's made us. We're made in his image and his likeness. So therefore, the creatives that we are, he's allowed us to relax and get it together. We didn't panic in the pandemic. But what we did was we reset in the pandemic and we got things in right alignment with God. So if you haven't done that, you know, while we're still in this um, this whole pandemic, this uh, um, the social distancing and stuff like that, while we're still going through this, Make sure that you take time to assess your life and make sure that you are focused and you're in alignment with the will of God for your life. Um, like I say, this whole time has just been opportunity after opportunity. And if I was going the way I was prior to the pandemic, I would not have met these wonderful people that I've met. Zelly and, um, you know, uh, me and my one good friend, her and I just, we've been able to connect on another level and, um, you know, <laughs> um, it's just so many people I can't name everybody, but you know, Damid, it's it's just look, I'm trying to name a few, but um these are people that I didn't know prior to the pandemic. Um, Marlon, um, uh Miss Kitty, just all these different individuals that when I say are amazing people, are creatives and are so tapped in and in line with what God is doing in their lives, and then they welcome other people to be part of what they're doing. And it's still all in alignment with what I'm doing. It's just, like I said, it's been a blessing. This whole quarantine has been a blessing. So I've been able to readjust, reassess. I've been able to read everything, re, re, re. <laughs> I've been just doing everything over, but making sure that my life is in alignment with God. And um, this whole pandemic has just given us opportunity after opportunity. So take this opportunity to realign yourself and um, meet some amazing people. You know, because God's going to do that. Once you start aligning yourself back, you know, in a healthy relationship to having a healthy relationship with God. Because I thought I had a healthy relationship with God. And when this happened, I was like, man, the closeness, how he's been drawing me even closer to him. And I'm sure he's doing the same with you guys. And I encourage you guys to, you know, draw closer to God because um, he'll start aligning you with the right people. You know, my God, mom and dad. Oh, my God. You know, just all the, you know some some dope relationships you guys there's been some dope stuff going on during this pandemic and um i'm just like again um just lucky again to say that um the lord has blessed me during this pandemic and i know he's blessed a lot of you as well you know um i've been blessed you know spiritually financially um again i got the two books done during this pandemic um well the second book done during the pandemic the one first one was done prior but um, my publishing company has shut down, but yeah, I hope you guys can hear me. Cause I just started thinking, I just, I'm just so grateful right now and, um, to God be the glory. But again, take this time that God has given us to slow, that he's given us to slow down and, um, take the opportunity to meet other people, place yourself in situations that you probably wouldn't have been afraid to, you know, place yourself in such as I was, but, um, yeah, I, I'm excited about what he's this next chapter 
um, that he's doing in my life and I bless God for what he's doing in your life and and you guys um, know I'm one of the biggest cheerleaders if I see somebody doing something amazing or trying to do something I am like the biggest cheerleader and I and I thank all of you guys again for watching my channel for sharing my channel and subscribing to my channel and I pray that God bless you abundantly and I pray that God keeps you and your family and um, you guys remember to stay healthy keep your your mask on I got a funny looking mask but keep your mask on and and keep your social distancing and again it's kente johannes with it's necessary you guys and i'm out uh oh yeah wait a minute the next video i'm gonna make i'm gonna be talking about my book um sharing one of the stories in it okay and